What's going on y'all? It's B, bereviews.tech, and today I'm going to bring you a tutorial on how to make bright, entertaining social media posts for your Facebook, Instagram, TikTok page, wherever it is you want to put them, in just a few minutes. And I'm going to show you the difference between Canva Pro and Canva Free, and why Pro might be a good option for you. So to start with, let's talk a little bit about Canva. So Canva.com, we talked about it in our last video, easy way to make YouTube thumbnails and all kinds of different presentations, photos, all that other fun stuff um, without really having to pay for anything, which is pretty cool. But they do have the Pro Edition and actually all the way up to an Enterprise Edition. So I've pulled up kind of these side by side to show you the difference between what Canva Free, Canva Pro, and Canva Enterprise actually have. Um, for most of us, Canva Free is going to do 90% of what we need. Now, Canva Pro does have some interesting additions, some addi uh, a few extras that are, are really nice to have and really good to use, but may not be necessary for everyone. So, um, as you see kind of in our big one here, our free, you're going to have those 8,000 free templates, 100 plus design types, thousands of free photos and graphics, the Canva app for design on the run. Now, the Canva app, I have this on my iPad Pro, is awesome because you can use the Apple Pencil with it or if using a Samsung tablet that has an S Pen, again, you've got that different functionality, touch functionality of moving things around and getting exactly where you want them. So a little bit nicer to use in that regard as well. On Pro, some additions in here. They're going to take you to 100,000 free templates. Honestly, it's kind of ridiculous. You kind of get overwhelmed in everything that's in there. Um, you do get the premium stock images, photos, videos, and graphics. Now, that alone is kind of worth the upgrade. If you pay it annually, you pay the $9.95 a month fee, basically, like $129 a year. Or if you want to just use it month to month, it's 13 bucks a month. So that's one of the things you can do. You can just use it for a month to get a bunch of stuff done and revert back to free for the next month if you need it again pick it back up you know a lot of different options here to kind of save a little bit of money compared to say an adobe subscription where you're going to need you know photoshop and lightroom and all that other stuff if you're not doing a lot of heavy photography that 15 to 30 bucks a month hmm, not really worth it because a lot of what you may want to do in photoshop you can probably do here in canva now a couple of big things that are here that are really big the brand kit the brand kit's actually kind of awesome you can go into the brand kit and set it up so that it has your colors your ideas your design for your brand so that they're all kind of at a click of a button i've not played with it too much i really like the idea i'm just not that artsy when it comes to doing things of that nature so something i need to work on and get better on myself but this helps you kind of do that um upload your own fonts and logos hmm. That's kind of cool. It's nice to be able to put logos in that you need to and put them where you want them. Um, you can customize templates. The big one though, this one click photo background remover. We're going to play around with this a little bit today to kind of see how it looks. So when you log into Canva on a pro account, you're going to see all the different items here. Brand kit is here to kind of give you what fonts you want to put in, what colors you have, logos for your brand. That way again, so you have them at a click. You know, they're also going to give you a content planner, so you can go in here and plan your designs in advance, um, save them, run with them. There's a lot of fun stuff that you can do with this, which is kind of nice to have this ability to say, hey, you know, I'm going to spend four hours tomorrow, and I'm just going to make a bunch of Facebook posts or Instagram posts, and then save them here, set them up on the days that I want them to go out. Um, nice to have this ability without having to pay an extra fee to do it. Um, so fun, interesting things in here. So what I'm going to do, we are going to go back to the home. Um, under templates, I'm going to go to Facebook post. And we can either choose one of the many templates that are here, which they have a ton of. Uh, you know, let's pick this guy because it looks kind of cool. And we'll use this template. Should be fun. Uh, of course, you can go in and you can change out any of the verbiage. You can add photos. Now, there's a lot of different things in here because this is actually a full set. So you could potentially build five different posts right here, download all of them and set them to go out on different days or at different times of the same day to keep your brand moving forward. So it's a really easy way to make that happen. Um, and like I said, a little bit of time, you're good to go. Um, one thing we are gonna do, I'm gonna go to my uploads, so where I've uploaded stuff and I'm gonna use this awesome 
a photo we took the other day for our YouTube thumbnail. Now the one thing I noticed is, yes, I've blurred the background out, which is nice to be able to have that kind of bouquet in there, but if we click on effects, you'll see right here we've got a background remover. So we're going to take a look at this and see how well it does. And this will take just a few moments, but a one-click background remover that's just included with the software you're using is awesome. And there it is. So now I can resize this down and drop it wherever I want. Now, you'll see because of the angle my face was on, the fact that I have kind of a gray color behind me to go with some of the salt pepper that's in my beard, it missed a little bit of that. But you do have both an erase and a restore function here. So you can always go in and shrink your brush size down, zoom in on this, and kind of paint some of that back in. So I'm just gonna round that out just a scotch. So it looks a little more natural, and done. Okay, still not great, but you know what? It's better than having, you know, a big chunk missing out of my, my face there. Um, now, the next thing that I would typically do if I'm gonna make, say, a Facebook post, um, I'm gonna go over to Google, and I'm just gonna Google, you know, inspirational quotes for business easy right you'll see all kinds of stuff pop up usually I would recommend going down to something like Pinterest where you're gonna find a lot of stuff because um, there's just gonna be a ton of things out here um, something like this you know oops I hate when I do that when I'm not logged in and we'll go back going to make myself so I'm going to make you so proud note to self awesome so let's put it in here We'll double click on this verbiage here. If I could type, it makes it easier. Or actually, because of the way this design is set up, I'm gonna change this around a little bit. So we're gonna put that there. Now, this font is huge. So, we'll go back up, just like we did on our YouTube thumbnail, and we'll play around with the font size. You can also play around with the different fonts that you have. And right here, just a daily reminder for you. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move this over here, and I'm gonna move me over here. So now, I have a Facebook post that looks like hmm, something to consider. So I can go from here, I can either publish it straight to Facebook, which is kind of nice, or I can download it as a PNG, which is typically what I recommend. And there we go. We've downloaded our design, now all we have to do is log into Facebook, upload this bad boy, and you're good to go. Now again, Canva Pro, you're gonna have the option to schedule. So once you've gone in here, uh, you can actually set up your Facebook page to where you want it. I'm going to schedule this guy to go out tomorrow. Uh, let's see here. Let's choose this guy. Cool. And we're going to schedule to a Facebook page. Now, I only have one of my Facebook pages published on here, so I need to go in and add another one. Um, but then I could add in my tag, schedule this post, and it's ready to go out. So you can do all of this within Canva, especially if you have a pro subscription. So that is the nice thing about having Canva Pro, is that in just a few minutes, you've got social media posts that are eye-catching, easy to get to, and fun to see. Now the other thing I'm gonna do now that I have this downloaded, I'm gonna go back to our Canva. I'm gonna close out of this. In our templates, I'm gonna look at Facebook videos. Now this is another interesting thing that Canva does, is they allow you to kind of put together these small almost gif like videos and have some of the stuff in here to play around with so you know we're going to use this template and what i'm going to do to do today i'm just going to make up kind of a quote put celebrate yourself in here we're gonna bring this font way down 
and I'm actually going to expand it out just a touch so that this size moves and grooves. Now, one thing that is happening right here is that all of these boxes are actually grouped. So you'll see an ungroup button here in the upper right. So you can group and ungroup different things. That way you move them as a single element. If you have them set up the way you want them to be, you can do that within Canva and make it a little bit easier to kind of get everything going. So here we go. And this shop now, you can actually go in here and create this as a Actually, we're going to say, do it now. So again, we're creating its inspirational thing that's going to drive folks to us to see the content that we're providing and why. You know, this just gets folks to get excited about you and your brand and building that trust that as an affiliate marketer, you're going to want. So another fun thing to do, what we'll do is we'll go in here and we'll click play and we'll see exactly what it does. There you go. Now you can't hear it very well, but there's actually music attached to this uh, particular slide. I keep headphones plugged in so that you guys aren't stuck with anything that pops up. Uh, but there it is, there's our video. The music is here at the bottom, so we can go in and either delete this music out and within Canva, there's actually a ton of music in here set up by type, all that other fun stuff. You know, the music that's on here is actually, I feel like it's a lot of fun. So I'm gonna leave it uh, for this particular side of life but you've got different options in here and different things that you can do there's even background videos in here that you can use and put in in place of the background video that we have so again there's a lot that can be done using just canva you know i hardly touch photoshop anymore i do all of it in here because why not it's easy it's saved to the cloud so i'm not taking up hard drive space with it I can automatically post straight to my social media sites and kind of be done. Now with our videos, we'll go ahead and go in here and we'll click download. There's different options in here. You can actually do it as a GIF, which is kind of cool. Makes it a little bit easier for Facebook. I'm going to download this as an MP4, which is a suggested. Um, again, if we connect our social accounts, we can post straight away, which is awesome using Canva Pro. So this becomes your one-stop shop. And at $12.95 a month or $9.95 if you pay for it all the way out, it's not bad because you're really taking the place of your social media manager now. You're taking the place of something like Photoshop Lightroom that you're having to pay for, put a monthly subscription on. You're getting an iPad app or a, a tablet app to go with it. You can even do this on your phone. I don't typically recommend it because your phone's like this big and, you know, it's hard to see. Um, but you have all of these options. And then from here, you can continue editing, go to homepage. I'm gonna click continue editing because I want to put this in here. Um, celebrate yourself. I'm gonna change the title, basically. The other thing you can do is you can share this directly. There's just all kinds of options in here as to what you can do with it and how you can do it. Um, if you are trying to build your brand even further, another thing that Canva and Canva Pro is gonna allow you to do it's actually submitted over as t-shirts, business cards, posters, all that other good stuff. So you can link directly to places where you can get these printed as a t-shirt and then have it put out on your site to sell to your clients. So again, a lot to do with Canva. Um, for myself, I've had a Canva Pro subscription for probably a year and a half to two years now, and I love it. Uh, I recommend it. I definitely recommend checking it out. Give it a shot. See if it's something that you like. Try the monthly for 13 bucks. If it works for you, keep it. If you get everything done that you needed to get done, dump it. I mean, let's just call it what it is. But as an affiliate marketer, having the ability to go in and create these posts and sit and spend two, three, four hours in a single day and set up your entire month's worth of post, that video post took us what? Three minutes to put together and download? Our picture post took two minutes at most for us to use and get ready and going. And that's as I was explaining it to you guys through the entire thing. Highly recommend it. So not only a tutorial today, you're getting a review of Canva Pro two for one for you today. Love it. So there you go. There's how to quickly and easily create Facebook, Instagram posts, uh, Pinterest posts, Twitter posts, whatever it may be with something fun and engaging quickly, easily, and very, 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 very cheap. Um, all you need is some kind of a statement, inspirational post, daily affirmation, whatever it may be that fits you and your brand. Jump into Canva, 
create a design based with it and post. Again, you can do this on the free version. You'll just lose some of the fun stuff that's included with the Pro, but I highly recommend the Pro. It is well worth every penny to pick it up. It's going to take the place of a lot of the software that you're probably already paying for. So do the math, do the break even, see how it'll work. And as always, it's your boy B, bereviews.tech. If you like what you saw today, please give it a like. Maybe hit the subscribe button, ding the little bell if you want. Down below, you will find a link to Canva and Canva Pro if you want to check them out. Um, you'll also find a link to buy me a coffee. So if you're really liking the content that I'm putting out and you want to buy me a cup of tea, please feel free. I know, I'm a weirdo. I drink tea, not coffee. Yeah, strange American. But I'll see y'all soon. That's the end of today's video. Y'all have a wonderful day, and we'll talk shortly. Thanks.